Hi everybody, just a quick uh, addition to the um, review I did of the most excellent Motorola Moto E 4G second generation that I did um, a few days ago and I'll put the links on the screen and down in the description below. So the Moto E, great budget Android smartphone, fantastic bit of kit and I just wanted to talk about a really cool feature that you can use if you've got Moto E or plenty of other uh, Google smartphones to be honest but I just wanted to highlight it with the Moto E and if you've got a Google Chromecast as well. So if you haven't got a Google Chromecast, after you see this, you'll probably want to probably want to get one and make sure you've got an, a compatible phone like the Moto E 4G. So there's our telly, and um, it's got that, that's the Chromecast screen. So I just want to show you something. Now you may be saying, "Oh yeah, well I know about Chromecast because you you know well that if you go into um, YouTube, forgive me for the quality. I'm just recording this on my phone, and then uh, let's go to me." <laughs> So I don't want to show you any um, copyright stuff. So if I select something in YouTube, this, my friend, I can press the, the little um, um, Chromecast icon, and that will then appear on the television fairly quickly. Hopefully, <laughs> won't take too long. There we go. There we go. Once it's finished buffering. Folding. I guess you could call it a vest camera. Um, that uses 120 film made by Halton so and Butcher Manufacturing I can control in that England, probably from my phone. You can go forward and, and change things and, and do that sort of business as well. Um, let me just get the remote for telly as well so I can so I can turn it down. So, so that's very cool, and you can do the same thing with compatible apps. So, for example, uh, you can do the same thing with Netflix. So if you go into Netflix, you can then cast to the screen. Now, but what is very, very cool about this on the Moto E is the fact that if you bring down the screen, and then we kind of get rid of that, we've got this little button here that you might have to see that says cast screen. So watch what happens when I press that Ooh, uh, nothing at the moment, let's just do that again cast screen sorry, press on Chromecast dining room Ooh, and what's that? well that my friends is the screen of my phone so if I get rid of that you can see that's that's what's on my um, screen on my phone there wait for the phone to focus and then if we go up here, you can see it's exactly the same thing. <laughs> I think this is amazing. So what that means is that any app, even if it isn't completely um, Chromecast compatible, for example, let's go into um, let's go into Twitch. I don't know, fire up Twitch. I'm just choosing something random here, just just putting it on. So what can happen now is you see. So Twitch is there. Twitch is there. In fact, let me, let me turn the let me just turn the sound off. Let's mute that. Okay. And you might say, well, that okay, that's all very well and good. In fact, let's hold hold that up. But watch this. If I go like that, and then Twitch goes full screen. Look at that. <laughs> and then obviously I can control everything on my phone. How, how brilliant is that? So there's no Chromecast on Twitch, but that, that can do that as well. So let's go back to here. So another thing you might want to do, say you were uh, surfing the web. So let's go to Google Chrome. Sorry, I'm having trouble focusing on this. Well, my phone's having trouble. And then I said I was looking for a Call of Duty Zombies game, which if I focus on that, you, yeah, it's, the phone's having trouble seeing it on the screen, but if I go up here, you can see exactly what it is when it adjusts the brightness. There we go. <laughs> and then as I scroll up and down with my finger on the screen, there's my screen. And then, so give me an idea. Say if I go somewhere with lots of pictures like Instagram. Instagram doesn't have a, um, a Chromecast bu button. But here we go. This is Instagram. I'm flicking through that just looking at it on my TV when really it's on 
<laughs> my phone. So that's great. That's how we're combining the uh, Motorola Moto E 4G second generation 2015 with a Google Chromecast so that we can do everything that's on our phone appears on our television. How amazing is that? That's absolutely, yeah, absolutely brilliant. So there we go, just a really short video. Just wanted to show you that one, just to give you kind of a, a it's just something that I thought was uh, very, very cool indeed. Because, you know, you can swipe around. There we go, that's better, you can see what I'm doing now. We can swipe along, we can go into our apps. Let's do another one, let's go into Feedly. That will uh, flash up as it loads up. And then I can flick through Feedly. And then when I want to look at something, I can just click on it and then read it. I think this is absolutely amazing. It's so good. Just combining a really simple, budget cheap Android smartphone like the Moto E with the Google Chromecast, which is what, £30? And your television, and you've got this amazing way of consuming content. Anyway, that's enough from me. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe and I'll uh, see you again soon.